Assalamu alaikum, how are you guys doing? Today we are going to learn about statistics. Now, an important part of Facebook is actually doing the ads. But the more important part is analyzing your result. Analyzing how is your ads are performing. When it comes to numbers, what better tools than Microsoft Excel? And here we have a tool from Facebook that will actually help you analyze your data using Microsoft Excel. Now, let me introduce to you Facebook Ads Manager for Excel. This is actually a plugin that you could download and install into your Microsoft Excel. And what it does is it links up to your Ad Manager account and will pull the relevant data to, to what you customize. So, and all this data will be downloaded to your Microsoft Excel. So you have almost real-time information about your, how your ads are performing within Excel. Now, the great thing about Excel is you could manipulate this data. You could do a chart, you can do a pivot table, you know, to, to, ex, to whatever extent that you are good at in Excel. So let's dive in straight. So the first thing you need to do is Google Facebook Ads Manager for Excel, and you will be brought to this particular page. Now look for the download link, download Fame, um, Facebook Ads Manager for Excel, Sounds kind of cute. So this is actually an add-on to your Microsoft Excel. So once you have downloaded the plugin, and I'm using Microsoft Excel for Mac. If you're running on a PC, it might look different. Uh, the add-on will be for Mac under the insert tab. It's kind of weird why they have put this here, but you know, that's how it works. Anyway, click on it. Uh, it will try to connect with your Facebook Ads Manager. You have to put in your uh, credentials and it will, it, it will authorize and link. Once you have done the authorization, just click on the Add button here and a right bar here will pop up Facebook Ads Manager for Excel. Now, the first thing, once you have completed that step, you can actually create a report. So create a report, it will now download the accounts that you have so you can pick and choose whichever account that you wish to integrate and download the data. So for instance, let's uh, choose this and you can start to create your template. Now, the template is basically the type of report you would like to see in Excel. And once you have the template done, you could just refresh the data again and again to have the latest data into Excel. So you don't have to go in all the time and create the report that you want to see. You set it up it once and you are able to download the data over the latest data over and over again. So for example, let's say I click on the create, it will ask me for the template name that I wish to create. Maybe I'll just say performance. All right, so since I have a performance here, I'll just put performance two, the level of campaign. You could actually go quite granular here with the functions. Now, this particular column is similar to what you have in your Ads Manager. So it really depends on what kind of data that you would like to download or what kind of data that you would like to analyze and massage and make an informed decision whether the ads is not working or you want to scale. Uh, I mean, the, here is the sky is limit. In fact, if you were to have custom columns, um, custom views that you have in your ad manager it will appear here as well right and you could have the breakdowns you can even filter your data to the level that you want it's really up to you have fun with it so next click on the create and voila you have the performance too here so now we can pick on the template that you wish to download the information define the time range um, I'm going to just put lifetime 30 days one day really up to you uh, click on the next and it will now summarize what it's going to download and click on create It will start to download the information from your ads manager account Now uh, this is going to take some time. So let's I have actually downloaded it before this So let's jump straight into here. So this is how the data is going to look like so you're going to have like a massive amount of data in your Excel uh, what I like to do is um, to pick and choose some of the data and some of the ads because not all the ads are being delivered. So just filter out to the active ones. So I'm going to jump in here. 
So this is what I usually kind of make use of uh, Facebook Ads for Manager, uh, Facebook Ads Manager for Excel. I look at the data and for the key areas like CPM, uh, outbound clicks. Why do I look at outbound clicks? Because my CTA revolves around having uh, WhatsApp communication. So I want to see how many of them I actually have clicked on the website link. What kind of CTR I'm looking at uh, and what since I'm most of the time I also depend on the type of commands and engagement there's my ads running so I need to see which ad is performing or not performing so with this kind of view I could set up a filter or you know I could just uh, filter it from let's say uh, smallest to large so I would just then highlight the key areas which ads are performing which ads are not performing so the more rates they have I mean that that gives me indication that this ad needs to go it needs to go away and if the more green they have means the ads are performing and might I probably need to scale this ad up but then again um, this is actually the way I would typically do it and that's my preference now having data in Excel you can go wild you can do a lot of stuff you can do tables chart pivot tables you can have analysis all kind of things that you imagine because Excel is so powerful what is important is that you are now have the ability to download the data from Facebook into your Excel and you are now have the freedom to manipulate your data to what you wish and the, from here you are able to now massage data and make informed decision about how your ads are performing. So, And it saves a ton of time because once you create the template, it's just a matter of refreshing it every other day or whenever you wish and the, down, the data will be there for you. So this is a pretty handy tool, especially if you guys are really into numbers and uh, trying to analyze. Uh, it's pretty good too. So I probably do more videos on how you can actually utilize the Facebook ex uh, Facebook ads for manager Facebook ads manager for Excel. Maybe in the later videos. Hope this video has been helpful for you. See you guys. Make sure if you have not subscribed to my channel for more Facebook ads tips and so on. Make sure you do and do smash that like button. For more videos like this and if you do have any questions or on facebook ads or digital marketing in general ecom please make sure you type in the comment below and i will see you in the next video Ta -da. Ya Allah. <laughs>